Howdy, 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 y'all. Welcome back. Welcome to Fort Destiny. We are back in Fallout 3, Episode 2. Well, technically, we're still in because I'm batch recording this. Let's exit the vault. Looks like we have an enemy out there. Let's get our bat up. Is it a roach? Oh, it is a roach. Okay. Easy peasy. Give me your gobbins. The game would be him too much. I call things gobbins now. Anything that way? I never did find that missing magazine. That makes me kind of sad, but let's go. Oh no, I went back in. Oh, uh, wait, what? No, no, huh? Did I make a wrong turn? Pretty sure I made a wrong turn. No, I went down the stairs. Okay, yeah. Maybe I made a... I have confused myself, and I should just be looking at the indicator on the bottom that's telling me exactly where to go. Silly me. Um... Ah, switch. I missed that the first time. Let's go this early direction. I kind of want to see... You go ahead and open. She's opening the vault door! Get the overseer. We need this door open now. Oh Lada. my god. You actually you. opened it. I gotta find my dad. Good. You're leaving. I guess you were trying to help me, but you... You didn't have to kill him. I wasn't trying to. So you say. Maybe one day I'll be able to forgive you. But not now. I hope you never have to find out what it's like to see your father killed right in front of you. No. Don't listen to me. Just, just go. Find your father. I have to go bury mine. I didn't want to. There's nothing here for you anymore. No, I can't. Not with you, not now. You'd better leave before I change my mind about letting you go. I, I tried not to kill him. You like that? I, I don't like that. I'm not doing this with you anymore. I'm done. But I won't take your bullets. I am not a good melee fighter. I know oh. I could just leave, but he probably Need has bullets like on him. One. Actually, he probably has bullets. If he had bullets, he'd be ah. shooting me. Please hold. Um, yeah, you. Ow. Stop hitting me. I am the worst shot, literally. Do you have any bullets? No. Well, you have a helmet. I didn't have one of those. Uh, I'll take that just to sell. And because you guys are jerks. Oh, I'm encumbered already. Okay, well, that's not going to work. Um, let's see. This one's almost broken. So we could probably... If I remember, R to repair. Right, let's repair you. Oh, it's not. Oh, we need more skill. Okay, so then let's... Uh, I don't know if these have guns in them, so I really don't want to drop them, but we can drop... Ooh. Oh, only 16% skill point needed there. Am I still encumbered? I am. I am! I almost said I am not. How do I drop things in this? Uh, let's actually go ahead and put on security armor. And a helmet. And then... Dropping is not with R. R is to repair. How do I... Ah. Right click. Uh, drop two. Drop one of those. Oh, wait. I'm underweight now. That'll work. Sorry, Amada. I was just minding my own business and everybody wants to keep hitting me. I could have just ran out the door. Yeah. I'm actually going to use a stem pack because I really don't want to go out into this wondrous world broken. We can edit name, our sex, our specials. Oh, I might actually need to do that. But we can add more points into these, I think, as we go. Uh, raise your skills a little. Having a high luck will also improve your critical chance. Oh, oh that'd be good to have. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't want to mess with it right now. So let's exit. Sunlight, though. Does 
that sign say? This feels like New Vegas. Scenic Overlook. Yeah, I would definitely say that. And do we cook food in this version or do we eat it raw? Quest completed escape. I don't actually know. Uh, that's gonna give us HP, so I do think we need to cook it. Hey, we leveled up already. Killing all those people. Welcome to level two. I turned everything way down, and clearly it wasn't enough. Let's do some in repair. I do want some in speech, and some in... Let's get that to 35. And then we'll do... I need to get our sneak up, so that will work good for me. I am happy with that. And choose one perk. 10% damage against male opponents. Uh, you get an immediate bonus of 5 points to both the sneak and lockpick skill. That wouldn't be bad. With each rank in the swift learner perk, you gain an additional 10% total experience points whenever experience points are earned. Years of the Vault League MVP have honed your hitting and throwing with every rank. No. With the intense training perk, you can put a single point into any of your special attributes. I think we did a bunch of that. You're obsessed with using and maintaining a wide variety of conventional firearms. With each rank and gun knight, you get additional 5 points to small guns and repair skills. Uh, let's do Swift Learner for now. So we can get some extra XP. And then we gotta head over to Megaton. Galaxy News Radio Signal Found. I do have the radios and the music all turned completely off. Might maybe find somebody to sell some of the stuff that we took from the vaults to. I'm not entirely sure. When I played it before, we got to Megaton. Oh, three frag grenades. Some jet and some psycho. Uh, yeah. Some tin cans. This really feels like New Vegas. It's kind of weird. That clearly said empty, and I opened it anyway. So we need to get a repair skill up. I don't remember if I needed these for something. So I'm going to take them. Is there anything to loot in these? Not that I have any space to carry anything. Oh, there is a... Okay, a beer, bobby pins. Whiskey and wine. Heck yeah. Might need to get to Megaton, unload, and then come back and do some looting. Uh, that is empty. Let's see, ooh, leather armor and wonder glue. Is that better than what we're wearing? I know we're encumbered. Why is music still playing? I specifically said no music is to play. I'm gonna walk away while I look at this. So we don't have to listen to it. Oh, um, there's a fridge over here. Okay, is that? Right now we're uh, nine. This is gonna give us plus five to melee, which I'm not really worried about. Uh, leather armor is actually better. So let's wear that. Eyeglasses don't really do anything. I don't know what DR means. It's been so long, I gotta learn what everything means again. And we do have the helmet on, so let's go ahead and drop one of those, a couple of those. They're, all, they're not worth much, so we'll keep one for if we need melee or speech to be increased. Fancy lad snack cakes and some mash in our first Nuka Cola, and we're encumbered again. Well, crap. Um, Drop you and you. They really don't weigh much. Those are actually worth quite a bit, but these are worth like one cap. That's gonna give us lockpick plus five. That might actually be very helpful. All right, exactly 210. We can always come back and pick things up once we sell off a bunch of stuff. Yeah, I'm not even gonna worry about looting because we can't carry anything else. Megaton, that direction. Yeah, we'll definitely come back here and loot this area up. But you never know, we might find good stuff to sell or to upgrade with. This, plays, this feels a lot like New Vegas, but I haven't played New Vegas in so long. I kind of don't remember all, like, it was very different than 476. Megaton, it says, is this way. Right now, our main objective is to reach Megaton. Hello, people. I'm Raven. How are you? Can you help me? I need water. Purified water, please. I have one. What is this place? Some kind of city? It's Megaton. Have you been living in a hole or something? 
Everyone's heard of Megaton. Well, technically, yes, I have. They have plenty of water in there, but they only give it to residents or people who can pay for it. Um, will any water do? Have this purified water. You mean you don't want anything for it? I don't have any caps or anything. I can just have I can just have it for free. I insist, my friends. It's the least I can do. Water. Oh, precious water. Thank you. You're a saint. Oh, sounds like we got a karma Welcome increase. What is Megaton. this? Hello. Have yourself a nice visit, partner. Uh, when I did my own playthrough, or when I was just playing it, this is where I stopped. But there was a trader out here, and that's what I was counting on. Maybe there'll be people we can sell to in here? Maybe it's only there certain times. I definitely did not loot the vault like I did. I kind of just got out of there. I'll be dead. Another newcomer. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. Nice town you got, hip sheriff. It's a pleasure to meet you. Friendly and well-mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Uh, message received. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? I'm looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him? Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. I could use some directions. Sure thing, partner. What do you need to find? Um, clinic. Our clinic is down in the crater, by the bomb. Doc Church is a little rough around the edges, but the man's got talent and compassion. Uh, what about the weapons dealer? You'll probably want to see Moira at Craterside Supply. She sells some weapons. Makes some, too, from what I hear. Her place is down by the crater. Uh, is there a bar? Sure is. Moriorities. The entrance is on the top level, opposite the main gate. Just be careful. Moriority is not your friend, no matter what he may say. So don't fall for his lies. And for God's sake, don't trust the man. I don't trust anybody. Um, I need some equipment. Where's the general store? Moira sells all kinds of stuff at her place. Crater side supply. Take a guess where it is. <laughs> um, can I rent a bed? Up at Moriarty's at the south end of town. Talk to Nova. She'll help you out. Let's talk about something else. Sure thing. What's on your mind? Let's discuss this bomb. What about it? Don't you think someone should disarm it? I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? Do you think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? I can see about disarming it for you. Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it first. Go easy. Yeah, we're gonna have to level if that up. If you get the job done, There'll be 100 caps in it for you. Um, demolition expertise doesn't come cheap. I want 500 caps, but I only have a 24% chance of succeeding. I couldn't sleep at night knowing you all could die. 100 caps? All right, I'll take a look at it. Great. Go ahead and see what you can do. Just be careful. The power of the atom. Um, know anything about the area outside of Megaton? It's called the Wasteland for a reason. But there are settlements, too, spread all around. The human race is stubborn like that. To the south, you've got Rivet City. But don't bother going to D.C. The place is a war zone. Go to D.C., got it. Now that I'm helping you, maybe you can help me. I'm looking for my dad. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Had a look in his eye. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Spend some time up in the saloon. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. That man's trouble. Um, tell me more about your town. What do you want to know? Um, I already know that. All right, shoot. Okay. Laters. Mind your manners now. Yes, sir. Okay, so what was the new quest? Go to the data. Okay, oh, we have a note from Dad. Let's Hold listen. on, Jonas. I need to record this first. I, I don't really know how to tell you this. 
I hope you'll understand, but I know you might be angry. I thought about it for a long time, but in the end, I decided it was best for you not to know. So many things could have gone wrong, and there's really no telling how the Overseer will react when he finds out. It's best if he can blame everything on me. Obviously, you already know that I'm gone. It was something I needed to do. You're an adult now. You're ready to be on your own. Maybe someday things will change and we can see each other again. I can't tell you why I left or where I'm going. I don't want you to follow me. God knows life in the vault isn't perfect, but at least you'll be safe. Just Not knowing so that will be enough to keep me going. Don't mean to rush you, Doc, but I'd feel better if we got this over with. Okay, go ahead. Goodbye. I love you. Let's go ahead and just... I wanted to clear everything. The password is a motto. Well, that's not hard. Okay, quest. Speak to Colin Moriarty about Dad, and then we need to disarm the bomb. Okay. I'd like to find somebody to sell all this goblins to. Also, I do want to look and see... Under weapons is okay. So if they're decayed, damage is five. Where's my baseball bat? Is seven. They um are worth less. So let's go ahead and repair you. Repair you. It's also taking some weight off of us, which is fantastic. And repair you. Oh, I can't. Okay, well, there's a clinic here. Let's see what that's about. He is coming with the clouds. And hello, hello, Doc Church. I'm Doc Church, and I run this clinic. Now, before you go asking me for help, you'd better know the rules. Rule one: Don't bother me. Sure if you doctor. do bother me, you better be damn near dead. I'm busy enough taking care of people I actually like. Follow my rule, I'll keep you patched up, I'll keep getting paid, and we'll get along just fine. Um, I need something to help me concentrate. I need medical supplies. Yeah? What do you need? I actually just want you to buy some stuff. You have 85 caps, so you could actually buy... Um... See, I don't know what to do with everything anymore. It's been so long. Uh, that's going to give us rads. Like, can I break these down? Here, have a paint gun. Um, have some pre-war money. Can you take all of them? 58 caps. Okay. I know some things I, just, I don't remember. I don't want the tunnel snake jacket because I'm not working at all. I do want to keep one jumpsuit because it's going to give us plus two speech. Uh, can you take one of these? No. Well, maybe if I buy some stim packs from you. Uh, let's just buy like two. And oh, then it means you could actually take four. No, four is too many. So give me this back. Uh, oh, well, you can. Yeah, that's that's fine. I'm going to leave you like 20 caps. I think I needed all these for crafting certain things, but again, I don't remember. It's been so long, and we are talking. Okay, that's that's good. It also helped us get a little bit of weight off of us. You done? Good. Um, What do you do around here? I'm the town doc. If it's cut, I sew it up. If it's infected, I cut it off. Okay, good to know. Try to be careful. Oh, I didn't ask about the people around here. Oh, this is not stealing? Oh, it is now. Okay. I'm thinking we have to do karma here. Come. Now, I know I've never seen you in Megaton before. Well, let me guess. Just passing through, right? We get people trying to settle down here all the time. Anyway, if you're hungry, you came to the right place. What can I get you? Uh, what's on the menu? Have a look. Most of it's edible. Some of it even tastes good. How do I cook my food? I will take some iguana bits and iguana on a stick. Because that's no rads. And you can have... Uh, that pistol. I'm going to save one pistol to repair this pistol, should I need to. Uh, I don't need the baseball right now. Have some bent tin cans. I see, I don't remember what 
any of these things are for, if anything. I don't want to sell things I shouldn't sell, but ooh. That's going to give us rads. Uh, police baton, police baton, police baton, police baton. Oh, you can have that. It was a birthday present, but I don't need it. Like, I know you need some of these things to, like, do repairs and such, but again, we're just going to have to get into it and figure it out. Security helmet, and that's all you can do. That'll work. Uh, 200 Enjoy. more caps. What can you tell me about Megaton? Some people hate this place, but I guess that's their right. But what the hell do they want out of life? Food, shelter, and safety. Works for me. What's the world around town? I ain't heard much, truth be told. I don't really ever leave the lantern. Too much work. Too few hours in the day, you know? I have to go. Remember us if you need something. Thank you. I gotta figure out how to get this rad roach meat. You're looking to trade, Adam. stranger? Check out Let's Craterside Supply. Okay, thank you. Attend now to the words of the prophet of Atom. If you Come need to buy something, Moira up in Craterside Supply. Of the glow. Watch out, though. For this ancient weapon of war. So we're supposed to go up this way. Can I talk to you, Nathan? Ha! Ah, look at this! New blood! Tell me, girl, you ever hear of the Enclave? The last remnant of the good old USA they are. Now, I don't know you from Adam. But I got you pegged for a patriot, and any patriot worth her salt is gonna toss her gun in for the Enclave. Any day now, they're gonna roll up here, and then this nightmare'll be over for good. But listen to me, Ramble. I'm Nathan. What can I do for you? Um, why do you support the Enclave? Why? Why? Look around you! This is the good old USA! Sure, she looks a little bit different these days, but you're still on American soil. And even if you were born in some underground vault, you were born under the United States, which makes you an American. And it's your duty and my duty to support our country and our president, no matter what. Understand? Even the current president? Ooh. You're right, my country deserves my unthinking and unquestioning support. Are you kidding me? It's the duty of a citizen to question his government. I 100% agree with that. I couldn't possibly care less about the government or president. Um, but we're playing a good character with a little bit of a mean streak. So we're going to say it's the duty of a citizen to question his government. Why? That's unthinkable. Where in the Constitution does it say that we're supposed to run around questioning the government? Huh? Old Constitution was good. I mean, it's the same con- I'm, I'm not even gonna get into it. Don't get me going on that. I will never get off the soapbox. Do you think people who fought a war with tyrants wanted unquestioning support? They did give us guns and say, if we screw up, feel free to take us out. I really don't know. I skipped American government class back in the vault. I don't mean to embarrass you, but maybe you should learn your history before you argue with a patriot. Oh, I'm very It's patriotic. okay, though. That's what we have a government for. To do the hard things so we don't have to. But what else did you want to know? Uh, have you ever seen the Enclave? How can you know anything about them? Who are the Enclave? Uh, yeah, if you've never seen them, how do you know about them? They're on the radio. They have been for years. President Eden talks about everything they're doing. They got flying robots all around, watching everything so they know what to do when they finally swoop in and clean this place up. You'll see. People think I'm just a crazy old man. Things will be different when the Enclave gets here. Who are they? They're the American government. The Eagle. People, comma, we the. The more perfect union. Okay. Uh, what's the word around town? I couldn't tell you, really. I talked to Manya, if you care that much. She's lived in Megaton longer than anyone. Later, Nathan. Take care. You too. Thank you for the conversation. Do you have a name? Oh, look. Another one of you wasteland assholes. Look here, asshole. I don't like you. Stay clear of me and we'll have no trouble. Mrs. Asshole to you? You don't look like you belong here. What's your story? There ain't much to tell. I used to live out in the wastes. I was a real bastard back you then. You still are! But I've put all that behind me. Doesn't sound that way. Um, have you ever considered getting back out there? What? Back out where? Out there in the waste, man. You must be bored to tears in this town. I left all that behind me. There's nothing but bullshit out there. Killing. Stealing, violence. 
I'm not that guy anymore. Well, you're still rude. You're right, that sounds terrible. Eh, yeah, you're right. Stupid idea anyway. Um, what do you know about the wasteland? None of your fucking business. Wow, you are a jerk. Did I miss something? What's your problem? Heh, <laughs> yeah, right. I don't think so. We failed. Whatever your problem is, I suggest you get over it now. You know what, never mind. You're goddamn right, never mind. I'm trying to fight somebody in this town I just came to. Uh... What do you do around here? Me? I don't do a damn thing. Well, unless you count staying pissed drunk and making Moriarty rich or something. Sure, I'm the best shot in town with the rifle, so everyone comes running to old Jericho when the raiders show up. But between raids, they're content to take my money and drag me home when I've had too much. <laughs> okay, gotta go. Come back if you need something. You just said you hated me and didn't want me to... Oh, you're bipolar. Uh, Lucy West House. I probably don't want to go into somebody's house. Where are we supposed to go? These are not ceiling empty with oh sunglasses. Oh, so I think it's a shot glass. I just thought it was sunglasses. Uh that's Jericho's house. We don't want to go in there and lock pick it. Who do we have up here? Door to empty house. Oh, because it's probably a house we can rent, which would be fantastic. I don't think I hit empty soda bottles. I probably could sell them 50 cat 50 cents. Let's go. Who are you? A settler and Maggie. Hi, I'm Maggie. I live with Billy. Billy Creel. Do you know him? He's not my dad or anything, but he takes care of me now. Anyway, I should go. Bye. You remind me of that. Bye, lady. At least you have manners. I mean, ma'am. Would have been better than lady, but... Oh, is this a restroom? Women's restroom. Anything interesting in here? Like a first aid cupboard or... Empty lockers, uh, a knife, a fork, nothing in there. Well, this is not a bathroom in good shape. What you got here? Oh, a carton of cigarettes and some Wonder Glue. That's money right there. And 18 rounds to drink out of the toilet. Oh, thank you. I'm trying to cut back on my toilet water. Just kind of exploring. One of the greatest things about this game is the exploration. Billy Crew. Oh, that's where Maggie lives. Got it. Moriar Moriarty's Saloon. Ah, uh, come on, you piece of junk. Every day it's the same damn thing. Hold on, because I turned radio off. I really need that to not be on. Yeah, radio and music is completely off. Let's go ahead and throw you down a couple. And then I also wanted to see if it would give me our activate item frayed HUD color. Let's go amber. Hit boy color. Let's go blue. That's fine. Light fade. Oh, none of that. Dialogue subtitles. General subtitles on. I want all the subtitles on. And back again. And continue. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave station comes in fine. It's Galaxy News. Their signal's been shit lately. Hey there. My, me? my. Mr. Just when I'd all but given up hope. My dear girl, I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. I am Mr. Burke. You're kind of creeping you, me out. Well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. That makes you a rather valuable individual. Please continue. I find myself enthralled. It does. If you've got a point, make it. As you wish. I'm looking to employ an individual with no ties to Megaton. No interest in its future. Megaton is obsolete. The last vestige of a cobbled, desperate past. It needs to go away. And you are going to see that it does. Or nah. You're going to destroy the town? No, no. I'm merely a recruiter. You get to have the real fun. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little motivation. I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge, 
Once rigged to the bomb, it will be detonated by you at a secure location. Easy money, my friend. Throw an extra 500 caps and you got a deal. Sims wants me to do it under my protection. You're going to leave now. I guess it will burn. Um, Sims wants me to disarm the bomb. Sims is an idiot. He prides himself on his position as mayor and sheriff of this scrapyard. Maybe some extra caps will change my mind. I'm going to defuse that bomb. I advise you against that particular course of action. If you interfere with my employer's wishes, you will find he can be quite oh, disagreeable. I'll take that under advisement. Now that is a disappointment. Well, if you change your mind, the offer still stands. Good day. Okay, I don't, I don't want to commit to that Son right of now. A, bitch. a traveler, Bye. eh? Oh, go. Oh, uh. Nova. Hey there. Looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. Yeah, I remember that man. I saw him talking to Moriarty. It's hard to forget handsome men like that. Uh, tell me more. Look, if you can give me more information or point me in the right direction. Yeah. I'll help you. Then Moriarty kicks my sweet ass out the door. Sorry, kid. If you want to know more, Moriarty is the only one who's going to help you. Talk to Gob. He hates Moriarty more than I do. Maybe he'll tell you something, but I doubt it. Uh, how much for a room? Well, for you, a room and some company will run you 120 caps. Up front. I want a room, not company. No thanks. Okay, then. Uh, story with the ghoul... What? Oh, I don't want to hire her. Clearly, she's a uh, prostitute. What were you saying about the radio stations? Huh? Oh, you mean why was Gob banging on that radio? Well, out there in the wastes, there are two stations that broadcast. There's the Enclave station. I don't know who they are, but I think it might just be some pre-war broadcast on a loop or something. And there's Galaxy News Radio. It's run by a guy named Three Dog, somewhere down in D.C., but the signal went down a while ago. Um, what's all this about Galaxy News Radio? You serious? Oh, you must have come from that vault, right. It's the only free radio station left in the wasteland. The guy who runs it, Three Dog, he's like the only person who seems to give a shit. He keeps talking about fighting the good fight or something. Better than the crap on the other station. What's the story with the ghoul? Who, Gob? <laughs> well... If you can get past how he looks, he's a sweetheart. Colin's awfully hard on him, though. Where did he come from? He don't talk about it much, but apparently there's a whole city of ghouls somewhere down in D.C. He's mentioned his mother a couple of times, but other than that, he won't really say. He's been here for, oh, I guess about 15 years now. Ever since Moriarty bought him off those slavers. Aww. Why is Moriarty so hard on him? Well, the miserable bastard is hard on all of us. But Gob gets it the worst. I guess just because he's different, you know? Let's talk about something else. Sure thing, baby. What did you have on your mind? I'd appreciate you not calling me that. I do not want to hire you, and I do have to go. Take care of yourself, hon. Work. Not interested. Work. Come on. Hey, hey Gob. smooth skin. You need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? Uh, stop it, ghoul. Stop looking at me. Let me think about it for a moment, my good man. Wait. You're not gonna hit me? Yell at me? Not even berate me a little bit? It's not a ghoul in New Vegas that says that. Uh, I'll beat you if I feel like it. I hadn't planned on it. Well, now. That's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. It's not your I'm fault. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen. Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you, I'll risk it. Oh, we gain karma. Looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him? Oh, yeah. I do remember a guy like that. Honestly, I usually keep my head down. I tend to get smacked around if I look customers in the eyes. But talk to Moriarty, he'll know more. Uh, if you know anyone else that can help, I'd appreciate it. Moriarty's your best bet. I wish you luck. No, I have to get back to work or I'll be answering to him, too. 
Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. What? I don't recognize you. New in town or something? Sure, I'm stopped in to find something to do. Who wants to know? I do. I'm looking for someone to make a delivery. Interested? Ooh, yes. Sure, why not? Great. I'd like you to deliver this message to my family in the Aravu settlement. I haven't heard from them in months, and I'm worried. As soon as you get there, talk to Davis West. He'll be glad to pay you for the trip. Yeah, that never works where I actually get paid. Can you give me some information about Arafu? Sure. Be glad to, since you're doing me a big favor and all. Where is it? Arafu is northwest of Megaton, on an old overpass over the Potomac. If you follow what's left of the river, you can't miss it. Okay. Do you suspect your family is in danger? No, not really. Maybe my letters just aren't arriving. Whatever you can do to get it there would sure be appreciated. And who else lives there? Well, let's see. There's Evan King. He's like the sheriff of the town or whatever. Then there's my family, the Ewer family. And a lady who lives alone named Karen Shenzi. It's Karen! Is there anything dangerous around here I should know about? What? Apart from the wasteland critters, slaver raiding parties, raider hit squads, and occasional landmine? <laughs> No, it's completely safe. Noted. If this was easy, I'd go myself, you know. Okay, let me ask you something else. Okay. And nothing, I have to go. Hey, thanks again for doing this for me. It means a lot. I mean, I don't know how soon until I do it. Also, Gob, do you have money? Hey, Pearl, what do you need? Um, I want to sell you some stuff. I need a drink. Sure I thing. do have money. So I have to, I'm holding on to the BB gun only because my father gave it to me. So I do want. It's going to give us plus one charisma, plus one strength, minus intellect. Uh, here, you can have a carton of cigarettes. Um, you can have that. Because it's just going to radiate us. Uh, I don't know that I'll use frag grenades, but I will hold on to them. Uh, anything else? See tin cans, toaster. I'm gonna keep that in case we need it. There's another helmet. I want one of all the outfits. Yeah, that'll work. I'm happy with that. See you soon, drunkie. Goodbye. See you soon. And we'll continue meeting everybody in the next episode. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, before I go, remember when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, be the change you wish to see in the world. Later, y'all.